the bear for Grin and Barrett. A little bit of the grizzly view. Okay, let me explain this something. What the hell's going on in this crazy red state of ours? Thought we were supposed to be all American and stuff like that. Give you a little bit of brief history lesson. Okay, 17th century, right? They used to believe this crazy notion that the kings were put in place by God. God was up here, kings were here, all the rest of us were peasants, we couldn't do anything about it. And here's the irony behind this, by the way. There was a guy named King James, and they hated him so much. He was such a, uh, well, a homosexual. Uh, that's the irony. See, he used to uh, give all of his places and offices not based on who was most qualified, but who was the hunkiest. Yes, we're talking the guy who wrote that Bible, the King James Bible, right? Okay, so, they hated him so much, and when his son took power, Charles I, King, they uh, uh, beheaded him. Now, here's the weird part. This, this proved to everybody one thing that had never happened before. If God supposedly placed, you know, kings in the, the certain power, then why didn't God step down to protect him? The people were more than have able to take his head. Okay, now take us back into present-day uh, Arizona. We have a woman in power here who claims that God has placed her in the position to, I don't know, guard his values or something like that. And so she took away the rights of uh, you know, gay uh, state workers and stuff. And she says she does this because God placed her there. What is wrong with this picture? So... Here's the thing. If you haven't already done this, there's a petition going around right now. You can go to www.recallgovernorbrewer. Tell me that she doesn't need to be removed from office. We could show her that the people put her in that place, not, not some god. And God will not step in to protect her when we take her out. Of course, we don't take heads anymore. You know, she should feel herself lucky. Besides, we wouldn't want that head anyway. I'm convinced the reason why she wears her hair in the way that she does is because she's got Voldemort residing in the back of her head. You know, just like Professor Quirrell. Did any Harry Potter fans out there? Never mind. Anyway, the point is www.recallgovernorbrewer.com. Sign the petition, and if you don't, I'm coming after you.